Thailand is uh, now complete. Uh, I've been back in the States a couple weeks now. Um, it's really given me some time to uh, think, decompress, and kind of really um, focus on what I got out of this trip to Thailand. Uh, a lot of people have been asking me, you know, oh, did you learn a bunch of new technique? Um, you know, all, all these like sweet combos, and and really, when I answer that question, is um, coming out of Thailand, there there isn't a lot of like awesome technique that I came out of. Not saying that you can't get awesome technique. Is for me personally, what I got out of this trip was uh, well needed time on the mats, just striking. You know, um, I feel coming back now. I have a, a much better game plan of how to develop my striking, um, how to work the heavy bag, you know, how to spar, all that kind of stuff, you know, that's that I can work myself now to really develop. You know, before going to Thailand, I had a little idea, but now I feel like I can really um, hone in on what I need to work on and, and improve that, you know. There is, uh, I can't say enough good things about Tiger Muay Thai, uh, everything from the beginning of the trip, the planning stages, um, communication was really easy with email, all the way to you know getting there via taxi. Um, he was always on time, you know, picking me up from the airport and dropping me off. Uh, staying at the camp was everything you need and want is right there. Um, I stayed in my little bubble and just trained and walked up and down the, the street and got food and did what I had to do, you know, and it was it was awesome. Um, not only the Muay Thai, but, you know, the MMA, the wrestling, and the Jiu-Jitsu, uh, without a doubt. Uh, Tiger Muay Thai, you can get um, everything you need or want there. Uh, it's a one-stop shop, you know. So, without this sounding like a, a commercial, you know, um, I, I would go back in a heartbeat um, and continue to work on that. Just because, as an MMA fighter... You know, they have everything, you know, top-notch Muay Thai, <clears throat> top-notch MMA, and, and very good Jiu-Jitsu, you know, top-notch Jiu-Jitsu. So, um, I feel that my time, my money was well spent as uh, an investment, you know. It didn't it didn't break the bank, but uh, it was definitely worth that investment. I feel more than confident in my next fight coming up uh, February 6th at the uh, Hampton Coliseum for the... Uh, 155 pound Spartaca title, you know, um, I feel like it's definitely helped round out my, my game and set me up for that success to make a pro debut this year, you know, as a ground, you know, wrestling jiu-jitsu guy going out to Tiger definitely, uh, brought my level of striking up a little bit, a couple notches per se, and, uh, to where now I, I'm, I'm definitely confident that, uh, I could face any challenge, you know, and, uh, and just continue to improve. One of the great things about you know training out there is you get so many different people to train with uh, from all around the world, all different levels, and it really gives you a chance to uh, see where you stack up in a lot of things. And for me personally, uh, training training with some of the higher, really high level guys, you know, UFC fighter and higher level pros fighting in good uh, promotions, really gave me a. Uh, uh, an idea of where to set that bar and uh, gave me some self realization that you know I, I can be putting out a little bit more working a little harder so that's definitely a coming back is um, definitely relit a fire underneath my butt to uh, push a little harder you know make that time to get the extra work in and uh, that will help me push to the next level you know um, definitely super appreciative for that, you know, you gotta you gotta take some beatings to give some beatings, and you know, a little bit of the beatings I took definitely uh, helped me out in the long run. You know, realize uh, where I stand and where I need to be, and definitely where I want to go. Um, definitely a, uh, a motivating factor for me. And that's that's basically it. You know, three weeks in Thailand was too short and went way too fast. Uh, I wish I could stay there longer. You know. Um, it's no joke flying all the way around the world and uh, getting acclimated takes time, you know, no matter how hard you push yourself, no matter how good shape you are in before, you know, the longer you can stay in Thailand, the better. Um, three weeks just wasn't enough, so hopefully someday I can make it back there and train a little bit longer.